Alright, right now I'm going to show you my belt buckles and the John Deere. I got the John Deere belt buckle. As you can see. And I also got Pac Man. And then I got a little southern Texas kind of Mexico style, whatever you want to call it. It's got the bolts on it and everything. I got, and then I got the Zelda one. I do not have all my knives here. I have a video of all my knives, actually. I do collect knives. There's a, what I mainly use most of the time. Is my little quick flick. Uh, don't even know the brand. I forget the brand. But it's a quick flick camo knife. I carry it a lot. I like using them. And I got my, I believe this is a Winchester or Smith & Wesson. I don't remember. I think it's Winchester because of the X. Like I said in that video. It's a charade X timer. Or timer X. I don't know which one, which way you want to put it. I keep it in a case because I actually like it. And it's a, I, I use it as a collectible because it's actually not nice. nice. So now I'm going to do some coins. Got a bag full of coins from different countries and stuff. I bought them at a. Actually, it's like a. They sell like Magic the Gathering cards and they sell coins. They sell all kinds of collectible shit and stuff like that. I keep it in a little bag. This one is actually not a coin, it's from the Indianapolis 500, uh, Indy 500. Looking down the road. I'm not sure we're finished here. Uh, from Indianapolis. When I went to the, whatchamacallit race, the Formula One race. This one's an Indian, from, oh not India, but India. Ten cents in India. I can't read the writing on it, obviously. This is India right there. So it's India. And I have like a little magnifying glass or anything. This is actually New York one fair. New York City one fair. For the... There's a cutout Y. It's good for one fair. For the transit authority. And this one is from. I think they did. I think that's. I think that's well bought. Can't really read it. They'll take a few extra moments. It's kind of dirty on the name, so I can't read it. Don't know where it's from. I forgot what I was talking about. This is on the back. No, it doesn't. It's like two cents or something like that. So the two on it, I believe it's two cents. This one is from Mexico. This is a picture. It's 1989. It is 1,000 pesos. This is from Jamaica. It is five cents. And I got a one peso right here. I like the design of it. Here's something that's different. I got another one peso right here. This one just has a dollar sign and then the one. This one has an N, then a dollar sign, and then a one. You can see the dollar sign, then a one. You can see a kind of an N right there. I have no idea what the difference is. This one's a 94, and this one's a 98. So, I actually like the style of the coin. It's actually a nice coin. So, uh, that's why I have them. This is one cent for the Bahamas, I believe. Yep. For the Bahamas. This one is, I believe, pesos. This is pesos. 
I have no idea how much this is, but I know it's pesos because of the back of it. And uh, this one is Elizabeth II. This is either Canada or yeah, this one's Canada. 25 cents Canada. There's a little picture of that. Here we go. This, this one. This one. This one. Here, I just took those over there. They're all the same. This one is a Netherlands. Um, 10 cents Netherlands. This one is. The Philippines. 10 cents. Philippines. You must learn to defend yourself. Zendo.com. This one is one cent. This one, I, uh. There you go, there's your other side. Can I see it? This is, uh. Trinidad and Tobacco. One cent, 1970. Coin. This is Canada, 25 cents, like I showed you the other one. It has Elizabeth the second on it. Then, uh, this one is the Bahamas. Elizabeth the second's on the front. It's Bahama. 25 cents. So the difference on the back. And that's it for the coins. Um, I believe I'll do another collection real quick. A small one. This is actually for the keychains. I have my John Deere keychain. I have a gap opener for uh, spark plugs on my keychain. This will come in handy. I have keys. I have a key over there. It's my house key. This one broke off the keychain. The keychain broke on it. It says my name. As you see, it says Robert. And it just flashes it. Once it has light, you see it's flashing. This is from South Beach in Miami. This one my aunt gave me from Italy. Mm. This one I got at Universal Studios, Bubblegum Shrimp. This one I got in Detroit when I went up to see the Detroit Tigers. I also got an autographed baseball from them. It's a $500 poker chip kind of style thing. Same thing on the other side. And I have a cross one. And I have a National Guard one. And it has a www.1800goguard.com on the back. And uh, I believe that's it for the kitchen. Well, for right now, actually. Wait, I got one more. A Mustang keychain. That's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this collection video. And I'll make another one, I believe I will, after this. And it'll be a very short one next, because I don't have much other stuff I collect. So, watch the next one if you feel like it.